that she likes like just because a woman rides it or a woman can ride it easier does not make it a uh, a woman's bike you know there's not one bike out here designed specifically for a woman you know and you know I think we'll just make a bike for a woman no no they just make bikes road glides, fat bobs, whatever. So, I don't see how any of that makes anything a girl's bike. So, uh, give me a moment and uh, we shall resume this uh, here shortly. But let me go check this box and uh, we'll be back. Kind of like that. All right, now that we are uh, back here, uh, I went to the mailbox. Surprisingly, I did have something in there. Fucking awesome. Who it is? I'll let you know in a, another video. But uh, this ain't this ain't about mail calls right now. This is about uh, these labels that I, I don't I don't understand, I don't like. Um, so yeah, so that's a girl's bike. No, it's not, it's just a bike that a, that, a, that a woman may like to ride. Why she may like to ride is, is, you know, maybe it's lower, maybe she's not as tall. But if she can handle a street bob or a street glide or whatever, doesn't that make those bikes that aren't a sportster or a slim a girl's bike? Right? So I don't, you know, so then, I mean, by that logic, like every bike could be a girl's bike, no matter what it is. It could be a V-Rod, it could be the FXDR, whatever it is, it's now a girl's bike because a girl's riding it. So the label is kind of stupid. Um, that, and, um, so, that's a stupid one. Another label is like the, uh, the geezer bike, the old man bike. Like I have to be old to ride this bike. No, you don't. You don't have to be old to ride a certain bike. I don't even understand that. I don't, I'm, you know, maybe you just like trikes, you know, who knows? 
you don't have to be old. Uh, you don't have to be old to, to, to like the the ultras and stuff like that. You just, maybe you just like to look. Maybe you and your significant other like to, to take long trips and that's just better for what you do. But it doesn't necessarily mean that you have to be, you know, in your 60s or whatever. So, I just think that it's uh, kind of a stupid stupid label to put out there, you know. Why can't people just ride to ride? You know, I don't I don't really care if you're riding an Indian, Kawasaki, Suzuki. I don't care. You know, as long as you're riding, then you're all good. You know, I, so I don't like I said the labels I think are stupid. Um, like I said, there's plenty of people who live and die by the uh, by the uh, the Sportster, you know. So I don't get it. Um, and a lot of them are guys, so <laughs> you'd be surprised how many dudes are on a Sportster. You know, so don't I did, don't say, oh, that's a girl's bike, because really a lot of girls are you know most of the guys on sports are guys so um, I mean just think about it while you're throwing out labels don't don't say oh my god as a girl's bike I'll never ride it but you can do I mean you know I mean the slim I mean that thing they were putting the 110 in the slim you know so hey So, I mean, there's women out there on, you know, the Softail Slim S that can blow your shit away. So don't, don't be down, down playing the Slim or anything. Just, uh, just because, you know, it's a supposed women's bike. Uh, I mean, that's really, that's really all I had to say. I just think that that's stupid, the labels. Um, I said, uh, you don't have to be old to ride an Ultra. You don't have to uh, be a woman to have a swim. Um, I mean, like, I just, not too long ago, I had a guy trade in a swim for a Road King, but he had that swim done up. Oh. Had bars on it, cam work. That swim was rocking, man. Two in the one. So, don't, just don't, don't think, think about it before you start applying labels, I guess is, is the whole thing. Um, nobody wants a label applied to them or their bike, I mean, you know, once you get the bike, that's like part of you, nobody wants to be labeled anything, except um, a rider, and you know, that's all we are, everybody's a rider no matter what the bike, so. Daytona Bike Week about how sportsters are not girls bikes because I mean you know of course the beach biker rides one uh, John Maxwell has one or sold it but he had one or something like that so um, don't don't say it's a girls bike because it's not uh, that could be bad plenty of people have them like that plenty of guys have them um, me personally I would have got one when I started but I'm just a bigger guy. I am in so much trouble right now. Um, so I think it would have just it wouldn't have fit me well, so I didn't get one. But there's plenty of big guys who have one. 
and there's nothing wrong with that. Um, it's, you know, it's all about the ride that you want and what you want to do. So, definitely, uh, oh. Check out the uh, the beach biker and uh, check out the video. I'll try to find it. Put a link in the description. Check out the beach biker. Um, check out his whole channel, man. He's got good stuff. I was watching it this morning. Um, so like I said, I'll put his link in the description um, along with that video. And you know, like I said, Sportsters, Slims, whatever. Nothing was directly made to be a girl's bike. You know, it was just a bike for different people. Um, so definitely watch your labels. Um, that's that's really the video. Um, so make sure you like the video. If you haven't done so yet, subscribe to the channel. It helps out a lot. Um, I find that I am getting a few more subscribers here and there, so I greatly appreciate it. Um, like I said, I just kind of do it for fun um, and to express my opinion because that's the American way. And um, so definitely uh, subscribe to the channel, share it with everyone you know, and I mean leave a comment if you you know you kind of are for the labels against labels. I don't, I you know, I don't. I'm not trying to stifle your opinion. Cause, Everybody's entitled to their own. I just kind of think it's a messed up label. But, um, you know, let me know what you think about it. And uh, we'll go from there. And like I said, I do reply to all the comments. Because I enjoy talking to folks. Um, so, with that said, I'm going to head on to work. Um, so, yeah. Remember, like, comment, subscribe, share it. And uh, I will see you on the next one. Deuces.